Hello everyone, here is Rathur Ji and today I'm gonna show you a short message peer-to-peer -peer, uh, protocol uh, which is SMPP using this we can send SMS and also we can uh, receive SMS so this is a technology using this we can easily connect it to our SMS server and its pricing is also very nice so there are many companies are connected to the SMPP so this is SMPP.org and here uh, you can read about SMPP using this we can uh, uh, easily communicate with uh, a GSM and send messages and receive messages so uh, let me show you something here SMS gateway and there are many companies here SMS.to, Matlos Lab, Matlos Lab and Vortex but we will work on the Matlos Lab this is a very good company we can easily uh, fund our Matlos Lab account and we can send messages let's click on the matlos lab and also we'll use here uh, this library which is php smpp or uh, uh, this library available on a github you can easily come here and you can get you can download the source code so let me just do uh, uh, create a project and uh, understand this uh, library and connect to our smpp so let me just uh, do it so I'm using here a uh, NetBean. Uh, so let me create a one project, new project, PHP project. I'm working on PHP. So let me just create a project SMPP and finish it. And after that, you have to just remove this line of code. Let me zoom in so you will see clearly. Control S for save. And just remove the unnecessary spaces. Then come back to here and just uh, click to uh, download source code uh, on the uh, git uh, from github so let's download it after download uh, source code this is a free open source library you can just come here and download and just go to uh, your xamp d drive xamp stdoc and smpp project and paste that library here and we need to extract so it's uh, extracted so we need uh, two folders first is the transport and second is the tr uh, protocols so it will follow some protocols and connect to our smpp so let's control x uh, cut this project and let's uh, let's delete zip file and paste that folders here in our project let's uh, delete this one also so now we have uh, two folders protocols and transports we will uh, uh we will uh, include inside our index.php file so let's come here and just again come back to our uh, php uh, come to uh, github and get uh, some codes from here so let's copy this code and paste in, inside in our uh, code editor so let's remove this code and paste here and just come back so we need three things one is the server ip second is port number and also username and password so already i have so we need to put here just come here sorry just come to in my gmail smpp details so these are the details this is the url server in place of server url you can add your uh, server ip as well the so local host is our server and port number is 2775 so here is a 27 2775 2775 is a port number and this is system id and you can also call this as a username so system id is 02 one five eight let's come back here username is this one and password we need to copy and paste from so this is an old uh, uh system uh this is old smpb account so it will not work in our system this is just for demonstration purposes see i'm i'm adding and showing you how this work because we will also run the project and show you what type of error if your smpb is wrong 
so everything we have added so let me just come back if you don't have a smpp let me show you how you can get so this is Merlos lab you have to log in and sign up it's easy or uh, to create an account so this is my account and this minute and passport first we need to log in yeah so i have a logged in so there are uh, three types of accounts is a developer account enterprises account and the bulk sms account so 10 sms will be free so we need to create a get account and here you need to type any number uh, sms so free sms number you can get from here with the kennedy number just copy this number paste here and then we need smpp then this is your email address where you will get the details like this mm, here like this just minute yeah like this of details the merlo slip will will send you on your email so this is very easy steps to get the smpp mm, where it comes just minute which step is that yeah i think this one so plus one add this number this is temporary number let's paste it here and this is the email where you will get your details of smpp and request so this will send you an email you can add here you can add here they will send you an email about a server ip uh, username password and uh, also the port number all the details they will send on your email after adding this uh, uh, after adding this we need to run our project this is smpp so let's come to our browser and just type as localhost and this is our smpp so when you click this type of message you will uh, receive so view the source page and these are the uh, bytes and something like and also let me show you one more thing here you can add your message just a minute hello this is your message this is the receiver receiver's mobile number so two things you have to add and also we need to send an id and id is uh, will be here let me just show you in a minute yeah test smpp test this is from address so this will be your sender name sender name anything you can type smpp will allow you to send up messages using a sender id so sender name but a message will not goes uh, and i'm not putting on my my number here when you add uh, right smt uh, smpp details here it will send a message to this number and your message will be this one it will deliver sender name as a sender name so this way we can use smpp this is a new technology for sending uh, sms to communicate to the gsm so uh, pretty much i was showing you about the uh, uh, SMPP if you like this uh, video please let me uh, uh, please give a thumbs up and let me know about uh, your thoughts uh, about uh, this uh, SMPP so thanks for watching bye bye have a nice day